Hey, Bubble Burst fans, what's up? Get ready with me. Um, I haven't done a get ready with me in a while. This is kind of like an updated one, I guess. Um, so before we start with makeup, we have to do our morning skincare. Um, so take them. Actually, I can leave them on while I talk. Sorry, y'all. So we start with this morning. I get it's like a daytime hyaluronic acid serum. Let me spin the bottle so you guys can see. Yo. So we start with this, and then we have the CeraVe Moisturizer. Um, I do this twice a day, especially with the colder weather coming. Um, and it kind of acts as a primer for my makeup, so I guess it's kind of helpful, but you know, I find that my eyeshadow is falling out still, so it did it yesterday with the, um, but that's also because I did, and then we have to do my hair, because there you all so we got this, oh, it is working, okay. So I just kind of use the end of the dropper to like <laughs> Ugh, you guys the product just got in my nostril. It's I got this for my birthday. Um, hold on, I gotta reload my dropper really quick. But I got this for my birthday. This thing is so messy, you guys. And I do put a little bit in my eye. Ugh. Ah, my freaking skincare serum just dripped on my pants. So I have the day off today because it's parent teacher conference day. Y'all, I tried to film. I think I have enough of this. I tried to film a get ready with me. Um. Yesterday, I, like, asked my mom if I could film a get ready with me yesterday, and she said no, because it takes me too long to get ready, and I would agree. So, I just go through and rub this in. So, I have my shirt on, but, you know, I had knee surgery, so I can't, like, get dressed by myself. So, 
Normally I would have my full fit on. Hopefully this is okay for your eyes. It burns a tiny bit when I put it on, but I think it's supposed to. And then at night when I take a shower, I use the vitamin, I think it's vitamin either C or A with um, orange. It smells like peach. It's really good. And then this is the skincare routine for morning. Now later because, you know, as you know, I require help for everything right now. I can't shower. So I'll have to like my cellar. Ugh. At least the skincare serum smells good. The skincare serum is also orange scented. And then because I'm blind, I put an identifier on one of the bottles. I did the daytime bottle, so I know which one I'm using because they're the same exact thing. But they do different things. And it comes with a dropper already on the bottle so you don't have to try and like pour it onto a cotton pad. I love it. I personally just drop it on my face. We gotta let that dry. Um, like I said, I never have all the time in the world in the morning to do a get ready with me on a school day, although I'd like to. My routine is so rushed that I just, I don't have time for it. So one of my pro tips is you want to, oh, oh boy, I almost dropped it. When using the, any of these serums, you want to let the serum dry completely before you put like lotion or makeup on. Cause if it doesn't, then you're basically just, you know, you're basically just, at that point, sorry y'all, I wanted you to be able to see it. Okay, so I think my serum is dry enough. So now I'm going to go in with the Cervi Moisturizer. This is going to take me a while, guys. Be patient with me. If you don't like long videos, I'm sorry. Um, and there was no, like, intro either. Oh, <laughs> jeez. I don't want to put too much on my skin for the morning, so before we go to bed, I will put some hydrogen peroxide on before the lotion because I want to, I'm already starting to get some breakout going on, so... And then I like to put my makeup on while my lotion is like tacky, but it's mostly dry. Because it will make your makeup adhere a lot better. Make sure the whole face gets some. Now, the survey wasn't dermatologist recommended. I had a Neutrogena moisturizer before I had this one, and the survey is a lot better. Okay, now that that's done, I'm gonna throw my glasses. Actually, no, because the lotion needs to dry. So, I'm gonna put this stuff away. Because I'm done with it. And then I'm gonna. Oops. 
so for my last birthday i got these shelves which allow me to have some wall storage vertical storage whatever it's called But you basically just hang them up with like a stud finder and I did one with perfume and then I had to y'all it was crazy I had to put because I had so much stuff I had to make a whole separate um shelf with my skincare and my hair care so that's why nothing's on one shelf anymore I did make an iced coffee this morning. I'm likely going to make another one this afternoon. Um, but I didn't have to deal with like trying to get out of my house today, which was nice. Because it's a whole process to get out of a house. And in the, you know, the car is much more of a process than the bus. Because the bus, I just sit on a lift in the wheelchair and they bring me on the bus. <laughs> Whereas the car, I actually have to do most of the work myself. Hmm. Odd. My wet and wild is missing. Y'all, my sister just got me my wet, like a new wet and wild. Oh, you know what I probably did with it, you guys? Just kidding I found it it was I kind of like chucked it in my room on my desk yesterday because I had to run onto the bus this stuff is so good it gives you you know the look of wearing lip gloss or like wearing lipstick without having to wear lipstick I also have like a tinted lip gloss um, I think we're gonna keep the look simple again because I'm not going anywhere but I know. This is the new mascara my mom got me. Um, it's pretty good for the most part. Um, I have a separate one that I gel my eyebrows with. Until it runs out, that is. I use this one to gel my eyebrows. Um, okay, so it was this way. Sorry, y'all. I have to put everything, like, right where the camera is, so it's kind of hard. And Olivia says I don't face the camera near you guys. I find that hard to believe. Um, alright, so we're just gonna start off with this foundation. My parents are at my sister's parent-teacher conference. So I'm home alone right now, just doing most of my stuff to get ready because, you know, I was sick of listening to McFly and I was also kind of bored. So I like to use like the sticky lotion as a, it's not like wet lotion to the point where it's going to ruin my brush, but I like it to be kind of sticky because I use it as a primer to hold my makeup. And this is like the less is more kind of look. Um. I might add some colored eyeshadow just to give it, you know, a little less blindness. The next thing we're going to do
is our eyeshadow. I would tell you guys what the name of this palette is. I don't know the name of it. It's just like a little rectangle. I like to throw some color on my eyes, but I have been using like these little foam applicators for the eyeshadow and they kind of suck, honestly. So now I use like an actual makeup brush. Um, I know it seems like I've been bombing you guys with content lately, but I haven't posted on my YouTube channel in a while, and so, um, I needed some content, and around Christmas time, I will family coming down to see me, but I'm going to try to do a vlogmas, um, I don't know how well I'll keep up with it, though. Do the other eye. Like I said, I don't know what eyeshadow that is, or I would tell you guys what like brand and stuff it was. Now, for my like when I do my lashes with the mascara, I can't talk during that because I'll mess it up. So if I'm silent, that's why. My eyebrows, I can talk during. Okay. I think I'm going to try and curl my eyelashes today. Maybe. Um. I find my curler again. I'm kind of scared. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Sorry, you guys. I'm scared. I don't want to hurt myself with it, so we're going to not do that. Um, so the next step, I'm going to gel my eyebrows because it makes them look neater. Oh, what am I doing? Y'all... <sighs> I like making get ready's get ready with me, but sometimes <laughs> I can't focus. I gotta comb my eyelashes. I have like this, I don't know what it's called. It's like the double brush. It has like a comb and then a little brush side. We're gonna use the brush side cause it hurts less. I don't have a spoolie to like neaten them out with because my sister took it, so luckily I do have this. Lily from Not Enough Nelsons, if you're seeing this, thanks for the tip of 
brushing your eyelashes and eyebrows out because it definitely makes them look a lot better. Okay. Now we can gel them. <laughs> Distracted McGee over here. It does take me a while to get ready. I'm gonna be Those are all gelled. Because I still have some of that mascara. Um, so I didn't technically need to open this one yet, but I did. And so, like, they're both clear. But this one is definitely... It's like a nail polish bottle, so it's like, I don't know. It's easier. The wand is a lot thinner on that one. Okay, I'm gonna do my lipstick first. Again, Wet n Wild Strawberry. This is the pink one. It makes me want to eat it. That's how good it smells. Now the last lipstick. Because I had one of these that I got for my birthday. And last time I had it, I ruined it and got it all like wedged. And the cat. Okay. Mascara time. Time for me to shut up now. <laughs> Okay. <clears throat> so the makeup part of the get ready is done.
we have the rose quartz perfume. Um, so this one smells really good. I love the smell of it, um, because it's just, like, clean and fresh. I was looking for a, I had this Sassy Girl perfume, I don't even know where I got it from, and it smelled like old lady, so I didn't want it. This one smells really good, though. I'll show you. This is just the cat. Y'all, I sprayed a little too much. It smells so good. If you don't like floral fragrances, I wouldn't get this because it's very floral. I mean, I personally like it, but you may not. Thanks for watching my Get Ready With Me. Um, as always, remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And click that notification bell for more videos like this.